Hello everyone, I hope you're having a wonderful day. Today we have a Maryland campaign event for you. Our first round is Dunker Church, seeing an overview of that, followed up by our second map, which is the Shenandoah Street. So going from a big old map to a little tiny one, it'll be great. But before that, thank you to our Patreon members for the support. If you'd like to support, go to the link in the description where you can get a live stream of all the broadcasts we do. You can advertise your regiment on the bottom of our videos and get raw gameplay footage of everything we cover with no commentary and UI. So our teams for today, on the Confederate side, you got i -Corps, Army of Northern Virginia, Mississippi Brigade, Jackson's Division, Missouri State Guard, and the 12th Virginia. Whereas on the Union side, you have the Iron Brigade, Sussie Brigade, Pennsylvania Army, 10th United States, and the Corn Brigade. Server pop is 215 right now. Imbalances four towards the Union side. Union has six on artillery, while Confederates have two. So infantry balance is two off. So as pretty dang good overall. Frontline reporters today, uh, for your CSA perspective, you have ANV, Army Northern Virginia Killer, and then your Union perspective is Ninja from the Pennsylvania Army. One rule for today is that each company, there's four companies on each team, uh, at least on this map, uh, each company is going to get two officers, and then on top of that, there's no limit on NCOs. And co-commentating with me today, uh, we have Nitro from the Mississippi Brigade. Would you like to introduce yourself? Hi, I'm Nitro from Mississippi Brigade. It's my first time here. I will. I hope I don't fuck up for my boys. <laughs> Got to represent. But uh, we're very glad you're here. So Dunker Church. Uh, Two quick shots from Union right now. Damn. Yeah. But. For a CSA strategy on Dunker Church, how does CSA win this map? Oh, to be honest, my opinion, as long as you keep him from crossing the road, you know, the road that goes north to south, yep. that's that's how I want it one time. So, like, yeah. And if the Union crosses that, you're pretty much done. Unless you can push him out. Yeah, and trying to, union dub. trying to push him out of the woods, even if you do do it, you're probably going to take a huge ticket loss in the meantime. Yep. So, you got CSA already starting to take shots. A lot of CSA on this left side holding the road. Uh, kind of close. On the nipple spot for CSA, you got i -Core. A little further left, you see uh, MB there. And then furthest left where the Union's about to hit, A and V, JD, they're pulling off as Union's taking the... CSA is letting Union take the corner. Corn Brigade leading the charge for Union. Yep. Looks like CSA trying to back off from a direct melee. CSA, JD, A and V getting completely shot up here. As Union aggressively takes that corner. I am... I'm kind of surprised by this. I mean, I yeah, me too, man. I don't know. I mean, you mentioned that you were at court. I mean, is this what did CSA just uh, want to defend this road? Yeah, it's it was iffy in court to be honest, but uh, this is not going to plan. The plan, original plan, was to hold behind the church, everybody behind the church, and then meet meet them wherever they go. This is what they did, but like, I don't know what happened then. Yeah, it seems, I mean, based on that, they saw them all go to their left, the CSA left, so they all... Yeah, I don't know why they didn't mirror. Yeah, it's like NVJD mirrored, some of the teams stayed toward the center, and they just got completely shot up, but really good start from Union. Have that corner, have free access to the woods. Didn't take a whole lot of casualties, and if they did, they respawned in in a matter of seconds. So... Killer, killer, is, my, <laughs> killer is mine to chat. <laughs> Come on, I, mean, no, I, I get him. And Union is on the move again. Let's hope they hold this. Let's hope CSA hold this. It's a good position. It will be. The question is, how is Union going to hit this? Union's very together. Yeah, it's blob tactics. We talked. We talked about that in uh, in the court. It's blob against blob on this map. The bigger blob eats the smaller one. Oh, got a flight from Corn Brigade on the left here. Yep, CB's starting to break and your Zap starts screaming to go forward. And Union 
I core got separated. Oh. Honestly, wait. TSA might hold this. Kill. I'm chanting kill. 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 Kill this guy. Bad trade for CSA. Holy crap. I didn't look at the tickets. <laughs> Killer's holding. Killer's holding, but yeah. And LCSA kind of held that line, but. I mean, when you look at that ticket gap, it's like two-thirds of a morale stage right now. Union has lost zero flags. Yep. And so they're just going to be able to respawn up there again. And CSA has no force to thrust the Union out here. So this is... Wow. Yeah, Womp Womp here with 8th Ohio going to the USA left, all the way left. Fact. Some kind of flanking. Who's here for CSA? Uh, I core. Yeah. Yep. They have the skirmishers for I core and they retreat immediately. Team scatter for CSA right now. They should regroup. <laughs> Not good. And Union should take advantage. It looks like they're starting to move forward. Uh, Sussy Brigade moving up to where JD and A and V are holding. Let's fuck these guys up. Go in there, go in there, go in there, go in there. Go, 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 Slamming into MB, JD, I assume A and V's in the mix as well. Uh, really only looks like some IB guys and Sussy went in there. Uh, as long as they keep that flag up, which the two flags there are starting to retreat. So good on their part. Horn Brigade looks like they're moving up now. Holy cow. Looks like 10th US is moving up alongside. Yeah, it seems like a dub for Union on that one on the right side. I have hit CSA down to engage. Wow. This is the, they're rolling them right now. This is crazy. I haven't seen a rolling this bad in a long time. Mm -hmm. I, I mean... The species of CSA everywhere. 12VA, i is back there with 12VA. Some i there, some JD. I mean, and left and right. You got any thoughts for how CSA is going to recover from this? God damn, I don't know for real. <laughs> they got to they gotta blow up together, man. We talked about this in court. We got to blow up and then nothing has happened yet. So there's no Steam chat, but you can use the in-game text chat to communicate, correct? Yep. Okay. Obviously, in a densely treed woods as this is, it can be a little chaotic. I almost wonder if CSA should try to force the Union to cap that point, just completely back off. Almost it wouldn't be assets. bad, but the problem is CSA has a hard time retaking that point. Yeah. You got Union CSA. CSA. Yeah, yep, yep. Hit MB. JD watching MB get attacked. Typical JD, to be honest. <laughs> they probably they might just not see it through the woods. 12 VA is counter charging. Oh, they're doing a flanking maneuver, that's why. Look at him go. TSA left, JD going in. Going for Tethny West. Through the bushes. They're about to take him by surprise. There you go, remix killing one, two. Great shots there from remix. And that's gonna hit yeah, you. Oh, they're going and JD's going and come on, keep going, keep going. A and B's pushing up as well. 12 VA tags there. Oh, no, JD's pulling back. Oh no. Union protecting those flags at all costs, which. Is Zapstar going in with a storm? You know going in. Come here, Zapstar. Come here. I got Zapstar. I got Zapstar. <laughs> that guy was happy to kill Zapstar. I don't know what that i guy are doing right here. Hanging in there for like 30 minutes now. Guy in the church. 
You know, you mentioned. Ooh, JD went in. JD going in. They're very outnumbered. Yeah, everybody outnumbered. Uh -huh. CSA just slowly getting chill chiseled down. You know, you mentioned uh, Shenandoah Street, our round two map, uh, being a generally quicker map. This might be a quick tonight. I'm just For crazy. real, yeah. Holy cow. Yep, that was, uh, yep. Surprising, to the least. Killer is asking what is going on in chat. I mean, would have done the same. Yep, that, that kill on the officer there. Uh, Walpole with the eight. Why are you going. The end of charge right now might surprise the Icor. They don't have a flag, right? No. So that's, I mean, they've been cruising around here for a while. <laughs> <laughs> They're going to get some Artie, it looks like. Oh, Womp Womp got knocked down by friendly Artie. Kill him, kill him. <laughs> get at him, boys. Get at him. Get at him. Be bad. Very bad. Very, what very bad. Fuck? Uh, what can I say? Team play by CSA right now. Jeez. I mean, I think regardless. No at all. I think regardless of what CSA does, uh, it's probably going to be very hard for them to win, if not any yep. chance at all. I mean, turtling seems like really the only chance for seeing the cap, so you have a chance to regain some tickets. But that's yeah, going to be a slugfest, and you got to retake that in what seven minutes now. Mm-hmm. Uh, it, it would be the only chance for CSA right now. That's what I would do. If I was a, let's say, token holder, I would do that, to be honest. I would let him cap. Let's see, you got a lot of if CSA. They would. Holding back. JD, a little further back. You got A and B, M, B together. Uh, 12th VA, moving further back. Looks like they're going to try to go down this road, potentially, in flank. JD's already moving. Actually, it looks like they might be trying to get behind, but JD is already... Oh, they go forward, now they go back. Seems like CSA is trying a flank on the left. CSA left going going around. Got some Union groups moving through the center woods, but... Yeah, it looks like they're trying to outflank the Union, but... The, the prob only issue I see is that if they don't hit together... Uh, Union's going to be able to defeat these guys in detail. Mm-hmm. Well, so yeah, yeah sure. I think CSA's trying Come to get behind to get those flags. Work. And... Uh, Twin Banner just ran. And A and V and MV are going to get a couple good kills there. Yep. They got one, you two, three flags down from MB and A and V. Yep. Hey, buddy. The mats are going wild over there. See, it's like two CSA regiments are sitting back right now. I don't know if they realize this charge happening, but. Corn Brigade, 30th Ohio moving in to assist. Now JD is getting very close. Looks like they're going to volley. They get a couple kills there on 10th US. CSA. It's like, no, 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 breaking. It's like you said, they, they're getting defeated in detail right now. They still have a flag. Oh, nice shot. Yeah, 12th VA Bing. probing, take some shots. Twin banner guys are going in there outnumbered, but I guess it doesn't matter with the ticket lead that you have right now over a whole morale. Icor, I I yep. And CSA should hit breaking any second. Union kids start going to play. Those eighth of oil guys could start capping, yep. Tenth regulars, we are still facing west on the road. Good pre cap. Oh yep, it's it's happening. They got piecemealed. To be honest, they got piecemealed. It's handing it handing it to the union right now. This is what CSA has done so far. Ethel is not moving to the point. They're just sitting still. I mean, the rest of the Union team is... They're not moving to point. They might want the last 10. They might want to draw this out. <laughs> mm -hmm. I mean, that would do the same. It's a pretty good game for Union right now. They're doing it again. They're doing it again. Loading their faces. 
And JD now half going in. It looks like they're just running up taking some shots. The thing is, the CSA is not going to gun it to the Union over here. They're going to go to point. You can kind of see that from... The CSA, right? Yep. A and B here. Uh, some i guys. MB there. And now Union is moving to point. And Union is capping. It's not 8th Ohio, though. 5th uh, NC is. That friendly already almost got 8th Ohio there. <laughs> I'm surprised Union or, waited this long, but I think or Doug. Get it. You got domed in the head. Rest in peace, fifth NC, but Union pouring out of the woods. Yeah, this yep. probably do it. Surprise, Surprise attack guy. from Union right there. Yeah, they're done this for. Yep. Go, go, go. go. Oh, you guys, oh, How are CSA tickets dropping this fast? Let me let me pull you. Let me pull the ticket imbalance for you. It's pretty high for CSA or low, I would say. Yeah, but even then, I it just feel like CSA is dropping insanely fast. I guess they are getting defeated in detail, but CSA attackers got. fifty-seven percent, I do believe, for Pry House. Uh, what about Dunker? Dunker's true, sorry. <laughs> sorry, no, you're good. Well, it looks like Union's gonna cap. JD's trying to charge behind, but 10th West is there it's to 52. stop. It's 52. Even then, Union is up by a morale and a half stage. Yep. Like, that's that's a huge pace. Honestly, it could be a morale stage and 1.75 morale stages. Anyways, uh, your thoughts for the round. Jeez. I'm, I'm, I'm speechless, to be honest. That was a... CSA, I don't know, man, and speeches. They slipped that up. I don't know how that happened, but it happened. Great great job for Union, though. Yeah. I mean, Union just kept the pressure up the whole time. CSA yep. never could never really organize, and they, they, they kind of did. And then when they tried to organize an attack, they went in independently because they tried to hit them from numerous sides. And Union was able to defeat in detail. So Union, Union, Union kept together. They did a huge blob. They kept together. The great force. I'm speechless. We'll see if Shenandoah Street is longer. That'd be funny if it, it was. <laughs> Would not have been on my bingo card tonight. <laughs> but anyways, uh, that was a quick first round. We will see you all shortly here uh, for round number two. All right, here we are with round number two. I think I can hear balls to the wall. So balance is great. I think fifth Florida balanced over. But CSA is just going in right away, as they should. JDMB leading the way already in the fucking lane. God damn. A flag bear for Union just spawned in. TS has got four flags. Looks like they're trying to hop over behind the house. It looks like Union's. I don't know. I think Union might be able to hold. They got a lot of guys on the left. Union left. Oh, Corner Gates come back. CSA may be in trouble. Wow. Union held that very good. Yep. But CSA's has all their flags uh, behind this white fence behind the house, kind of in cover. You can shoot through the fence, uh, which you got. Ninja, yep. yeah. Yeah, Ninja's lighting it up right now. Ran out of bullets. Yeah, but survives. If only CSS has Adardi right now, they could fuck him up on point. Do they have Adardi on this map? Yes, I am a French Battery 8th in Mississippi. Oh, there... I know this map by heart. There's one guy I can hit there. point. It's my guy, older. <laughs> Let's, hope he Let's hope he remembers. 
So CSA just bonsaiing into this point. Tickets are relatively even. CSA is making it in the push. And it looks like they're pushing through a little bit and they're starting to cap that point. I mean, there's a get, tickets are equal. Turkey West and uh, Eighth Ohio is on the left side for Union. Union have lost the point. Oh no! Zombie mode! Zombie mode! <laughs> Someone just yelled zombie mode. That's crazy. Yo, you go in there. You're gonna remix, remix, trash talking. It's going wild in there. It's like a boxing match. They're right there, damn it. They're right there. Fire south, fire south. Remix got worn. <laughs> oh no. I don't want to die. Oh, All the wall. Shoot right. CSA took point. Surprising. Hell yeah. Good job. And they've won the battle. Thank you all for tuning in. I hope you enjoy. Nice. Got plenty more. <laughs> oh, twin banners, Iron Brigade trying to go in. But they're not going to be able to do that. I mean, you're not wrong. It's pretty hard for Union to take that back. Yep. CSA should really try to hit Union down to engage before they fully cap. I don't know if it'll happen, though, just so that counterattack times 12 minutes instead of 20. Mm -hmm. It'd just be what is delaying the inevitable. That's the term. Surprise Union doesn't have anybody on the rocks. The north side rocks up there. Usually it's a prime spot. It's a prime spot, yeah, it's usually used. Well, 20 minutes. This round's gonna be longer than uh, the previous round. Longer than Tyson versus Jake Paul. <laughs> well, more entertaining as well. I mean, we saw Tyson's buck cheeks, so I don't know. <laughs> that, was, <laughs> that was insane. The most memorable moment of the night is not even the fight, in my opinion. Ninja and some others trying to peek around that corner. But jeez, this is... Not like Union flags really matter, but one of them is down. You got CSA kind of holding in the road here. Uh, ANV and a uh, multitude of other guys holding there. There's a tactic that I don't think nobody used. But you could line up on that white wall. Uh, just past the bridge on the south side of point and you could just shoot through the wall and just decimate CSA I've never seen Union do it I feel like it's just blind shots so it might be hard but it's, it's so crammed in there like pretty sure you won't miss oh wait are you saying the fence um, yeah yeah if you all, if you're directly on point, point where CSA is in yeah behind the stone wall and you watch south if you go a few in lines up there, I'm pretty sure. Oh, yeah, no, he's pretty sure your defense ain't like him on that stone wall. It's a tactic I've, I've thought about, but never used it yet. That's so I give the initiative one day. So, one way Union could win this uh, is they could try to push CSA in the last stand because they're considered the defending team now. They got 18 minutes to do so. And if they charge non-stop, they will have plenty of time to make that happen. Definitely, yeah. But we'll see how the ticket gap is, because Union will hit final push, and that gold timer could drop. Let's go! And here they go. Oh yeah. Zapstar, first to lead. And the thing is, the the condition that Union wins with CSA in last stand, you know, the, the tickets have to be close, which uh, they are not. It's a half mile stage. You can just see the Union bar dropping. Listen to the pipes! Listen to the pipes! Surprisingly, Shenandoah is only 13% more for CSA. Yeah. And Ticket Drain is worse than Dunkers right now. <laughs> <laughs> but 
CSA win that, no surprise there. They got that stone wall on point that they can use pretty dang well. Uh, some of those CSA guys are using those rocks that you mentioned earlier. Yep. Right on the edge of out of bounds. But, wow. It's a pretty good spot, yeah. I'm very surprised USA didn't use that at first. You got Corn Brigade on the USA left, CSA right, by the river over there. They are the last Union group. They believe they got stopped. Some kind. And B seems, Nate seems to be going in. And surprise CB is not charging in with uh, the rest of their team. Yeah, they could have done a sweep with the Zap Star when they led when he led that one. They could have done a sweep on the left, went around, yep. get the backside of CSA. Could have been good. Get those flags. But here comes Union that's, again. That's yep. That's usually the that's usually the strat that is used by Union. Two middle, two left, go around. That's how they take the point back. Oh, Zap Star got domed by an Ico I mean, I'm I'm like him. I usually learn first to lead. I'm always, always first online. Not scared to die. And Sussy Brigade's gonna charge on the south side. Oh shit! Sorry, Jeff. They're counter-charging a few CSA guys that charged at him. Corn Brigade's flanking around the far side now. And the rest of the Union at main is just sitting back and shooting. Good oh. flank, good flank from Corn Brigade, yep. The rest of the Union team is not backing him up, though. They're coming from the left, too, guys. They're coming from our left, as well. Oh, watch your watch your flank, watch your flank. Not all the corn brigade went in. Uh, Only a few of them. Only 30 other went in. Eighth stayed back. Oh uh, yeah, it seems that way. It's that bad, but not bad idea. They're covering the left side. I'm getting lost. There are some Union guys trying to get up on those rocks you were talking about. And interestingly, Ooh. at the US. Yeah, interesting. Uh, this is probably, yeah, it's out of bounds, but you got 30 seconds. Death from above. <laughs> I guess they will go down to take the losses here. Someone Kyle! Can... Good job, Kyle. Killed that officer. Who's gonna die to fall damage? Who's gonna die to fall damage? Oh, they're not. They're smart. The ragdolls, though. <laughs> yeah, ragdolls are crazy. Corn Brigade's completely reformed where they've been holding. They seem, Union, Union seems to be regaining ground a bit, left and right. Slowly. They get so not in their favor, though. Thirtieth Ohio is gonna charge in. Nate's got a nice little angle. Oh, to the right. rip, Nate. Great job, go. <laughs> Rinse and repeat, boys. And CSA now at taking losses. Union's got to catch up on tickets if they want any chance. Here they go again. Thirtieth Ohio the with the flight. They're coming from the north. They're coming from the north. IV and Twin Banners kind of putting pressure, shooting through that fence. I Ooh, IV. Yeah, man, they read my fucking mind. It's blind shots, but I mean, you're probably hitting something. <laughs> There's so much CS. It's so there. packed, yeah, it's so packed. You're hitting something. Union charging left and right. Union holding. Wait, A and V. 
A and V charge the CSA right, kill the two flags, two flags down, oh, damn. I didn't realize there was two over here. Friendly, 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 friendly. Looks it like kinda got... gonna get him back, friendly, friendly, friendly. Yeah, about to hit breaking. It was a good charge though, from A and V. Dang, Union's gonna hit final push and we're probably gonna see that gold timer drop. Keep watch south southeast boys. There's a flag right on the other side. FUS the still holding that top. JD and Icor those skirmishers trying to contest. Jeez. <laughs> this is about what I was expecting with Shenandoah. It's nice to see it though after not watching the, uh, this match in a while. It's like uh Happy River Crossing and uh event in a long time, but I don't think anyone wants to play that. <laughs> Nobody wants to play River Crossing. It's so sad, though. It's such a good map. Union, it's easily winnable as Union nowadays. Yep. They, the devs need to lower the amount of tickets Union has. It's the only way you're going to make that map great again. So, Union keeping their respawns. Uh, looks like A and V is trying to flank uh, alongside Goondog. Shooting pistols down the flank of Union. You got some guys up on the railroad as well. Yeah, Zoo on the railroad with his uh, fifth Florida sniping. So, 10 minutes left on that gold timer. I mean, the only way Union's going to break CSA is by mass charging them out, and uh, they mm -hmm. are nothing but organized. But frankly, you can't do a whole lot on Shenandoah Street. They're on the right fence, right the right. Are there boys? JD going in somewhere. Oh, <laughs> They're just trying to, like, all right, let's finish this up. They got a flag down. That's good. Ninja is running to where that flag is, though. Good ninjas! <laughs> oh, we got shot. <laughs> Rip ninja. Jeez. Nine minutes left. So we have a little time here. Uh, what ended up getting you in the War of Rights, by the way? <sighs> the real story. No bullshit. My friend was playing Assassin's Creed 3. He was a red coat. And he was killing red coats. And I'm like, man, I, I want to play a good, you know, musket firing game. That's what I told myself. Just, just a musket firing game. And then I looked it up on Steam and I saw War Rights. And I'm like, ah, that seems great. So I then downloaded it, played a few matches, and then joined. Just Went through the War Rights Discord and then boom, joined 18 Mississippi out of nowhere. That's playing, every, yeah, been playing every week since ever since. And how long ago was that? Uh, I started 11th of February, February, February uh, 2023, I think. Okay. That's that's 20. pretty neat. That that's that's the only Assassin's Creed game I've ever played. Just out of nowhere, you know, he was just playing, playing red coats, and I'm like, that would be fun. I had an old fast before, but like, it's too sweaty, you know. I'm not that much of a sweat, you know. So. Here comes you. But, uh, One last two rounds. Uh, final push. I wonder what that gold time is gonna drop to. I mean, they got TSA to breaking. I did. Union's trying to flank around the far side as well. TSA counter charging, winning at least on the point initially. That flank around though. And there they go. One in one minute forty seconds. That's low for a final push timer. I tried playing hold fast, but it seemed way too arcadey for me. I kind of like it, but it's just the melee part. It's a little sweatiness. It's crazy. Yeah. I'm not, you know, I'm not that sweaty, so. When I, when I played Beacoff, uh, the few times I have, 
I, I didn't even bother. I was just spamming the stab button because I'm like, this is all I know. <laughs> Union just is zerging. JD moved up to slow them down. Yeah, I mean, if Union can miraculously hit CSA in the last stand and start winning on that point in 53 seconds, uh, they could pull it off. <laughs> Red Army Tactics right here by Union. <laughs> My, uh... Spayos and go. Company of Heroes 2, when I do the Soviet campaign, I would just spawn the basic soldier and just model him in. Yep. And try to get upgrades, because I just thought it was funny. Union collapsing on both sides. 30 seconds left. The Union gets more bodies on point when that clock hits zero. Uh, they can force an overtime. I don't think that'll happen, though. The CAC still has firm control. 15 seconds. And almost close to last 10. Uh, CSA still has the control of point. Yeah. Nitro, your thoughts for our round here? I mean, it's good job overall, to be honest. Average, average Shenandoah. Good job for Union. <laughs> almost got him last 10. I mean, better than Dunkers, let me tell you that. <laughs> it's like the inverse of each other, both of these rounds were. Yep. But, yeah, no, I yeah, mean, that's uh, that cool. I mean, Union held one charge, which frankly is a lot better than than most Union defenses on Shenandoah. But, yep. in the end, kind of what happened, uh, not really too surprising. I think Union did good. Uh, Again, the only way you're really winning that is by hitting CSA in the last stand. Um, and Union charged yeah. in a couple times, like Corn Brigade. I love that they charge in from the behind, but when you do it by yourself, unfortunately, it's not going to be as effective as you want. But that's with any charge in this game. So in the end, it's fun. But thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe if you want to support the channel more. We have our Patreon where you can get a live stream of all the broadcasts we do. You can advertise your regiment on the bottom of our videos. Get raw, clean, play footage, and more. We also have our Discord and merch, but besides that, thank you all for tuning in, and we'll see you in the next one. Have a wonderful rest of your night.